Syria has destroyed or disabled all of its declared chemical weapons production and mixing facilities, according to the international watchdog. Damascus had until Friday to do so, having agreed to eliminate its entire chemical stockpile in a Russian-American broker deal. Washington had earlier threatened to use force after hundreds were killed in a sarin attack in August. Teams from the Nobel Peace Prize winning Organization for the Prohibition of Chemical Weapons have been inspecting sites. Syria has already given our executive council what's called a general plan of destruction to eliminate that whole stockpile. And by the 15th of November in two weeks, our executive council will have to approve a plan uh, to ensure that the entire weapons program and all of the related materials are destroyed irreversibly by 30th of June of 2014. UN envoy Lakdar Brahimi has been in Damascus talking to opposition leaders and others to try to shore up support for faltering peace talks to end Syria's civil war, in which more than 100,000 people have been killed. On Wednesday, he met President Assad, who told him that negotiations to end the conflict would only succeed if foreign powers ended support for rebels fighting to overthrow him.